praise God because to live is Christ and to die is gain. So we shouldn't be afraid of that transition either. Right. And and prepare. Right. Prepare. Uh, I just wanted to add one thing. A sister uh, in Christ told me yesterday, and this might uh, help in your preparations, is that uh, she's only had about five of these visions over the years, but they always come true. And um, she said she had this image, a vision of uh, fireballs going and coming on here in America um, and heard the voice say, March 21st, March 21st, and it was terror everywhere. <clears throat> and then, um, wow, I'm just shaking. <laughs> uh, she, wa she asked for clarification and it said Wednesday, March 21st, and that's in 2018. Great, Trish. I, I don't know I, why I was led to... She just told me that yesterday, and right as I was talking right now, I just started... They've always been shaking. accurate. Yeah. The ones that are accurate, She's a my dear sister. out there, are um, not ones that you're going to get on the big prophecy channel. The, pro the accurate prophecy, you're going to get like this underground, whispered to you. I hope you know the difference between, you know, the two things because we have, you know, the commercial prophecy thing, which they're always wrong, and then every once in a while there's this word. Now, I, I you know, the track record is one thing, but you know, it, it, I, I, am, I know this person, a person of integrity, and I can just tell you that they don't, you know, they don't profit by having a vision every how many years? I, she said she only had five. In her lifetime. Five in her lifetime. So you see, that's that's something I would pay attention to. So that's Wednesday, March 21st, 2018. A time, I suppose, of great chaos and unrest yeah. in the world. 